ionization enthalpies. The ionization enthalpies of D block elements, particularly if we are talking about the 3D series, is very high. It is because of the poor screening of the 3D electrons. So what we find is from scandium From scandium, what we find is the ionization enthalpies, definitely it's a usual trend, it will increase across the series because the nuclear charge keeps on increasing and the electrons are added to the same subshell. So due to the increase on the nuclear charge and the size remains almost the same because the electrons are added to the same subshell, the, what we find is the ionization enthalpies increases. So from scandium to vanadium, what we find is it increases. Then about from chromium to almost up to nickel, it remains almost the same. And then from copper onwards, it, it still increases. But if we see those values minutely, what we will find is, as such, the trend is not very uh, regular. It's almost an irregular trend, though it is increasing across the series in general. But if, the, if we see minutely, we find it's irregular. The main reason is, I'm talking about the first ionization enthalpy. The reason is because we know we have 3D 1 to 10 and 4S 1 to 2. When the elect first electron is taken out from this 4S, these the energies are the electrons in the 3D and the 4S, they what they rearrange themselves so that they have maximum exchange energies. Now, due to these rearrangements, which takes place in different different elements in different ways, what we find is as such we have a uh, lot of differences. Now, we don't find such differences in case of chromium, the reason being, and in case of copper, the reason, that is why their energies are very similar to their previous elements. The reason is because they don't have any choice of any alteration in the number of electrons. Uh, there is no, as such, jumping can be taking place from the 4S to 3D. The reason being because they all are having only one, one electron in the 4S. Rest of the elements, what we find is, they, yes, they show changes and zinc being having the highest ionization enthalpies because of the completely filled 3D10 and 4S2 configurations. So what we find, this is the trend usually we have in case of 3D series. When we move down, what we find is the 4D series elements are having lower ionization enthalpies than the 3D. The reason being we're pretty obvious because the sizes are larger than the 3D and what they have is the electron to some extent gets screened. But what we find is, when we move to the 5D series, what we find is, 5D series ionization enthalpies and 4D series ionization enthalpies are quite comparable. The ionization enthalpies of 5D series are very high. The reason being, their electrons are poorly screened or it is mainly, actually, the reason is due to the lengthwise contraction. Because the poor screening of the 4F leads to what poor screening of the 5D electrons also. That is why the electrons of the 5D are under the direct influence of the nucleus and their ionization enthalpies are high. 